to further enhance the reach and effectiveness of its social assistance programs and improve the targeting and coverage of assistance to vulnerable persons in St. Lucia, the Ministry of Equity, Social Justice and Empowerment has officially launched the Feedback Redress Mechanism, FRM. The FRM, part of a broader implementation of the National Social Protection Policy 2022-2030, to provides an avenue for citizens and beneficiaries of social assistance to offer feedback or submit complaints about varied program services. The platform Form will be available to all individuals and families accessing social assistance programs across various sectors, including the Ministry of Equity, the SSDF, the Ministry of Health, and the Ministry of Education. Beneficiaries can use the FRM to highlight concerns, report issues, or offer suggestions on how programs can better serve the community. The goal is to ensure that those most in need receive appropriate support while giving decision makers the insights they need to redirect resources where necessary. Permanent Secretary of the Ministry of Equity, Social Justice and Empowerment, Dr. Sharmin Hippolyte Manuel, says the FRM is not only a tool for feedback but a dignified platform, ensuring that everyone who depends on these social services has the means to be heard for the system to respond effectively. The Ministry of Equity, Social Justice and Empowerment prides itself in improving service delivery. As we strive toward excellence, we want to ensure that our people are heard and responded to. I'm confident that with this approach, it will certainly help strengthen our existing social protection initiatives and help boost the confidence of our service users. The participation of key stakeholders, including social transformation officers, members of the welfare unit, non-governmental organizations, and the St. Lucia Social Development Fund, highlights their essential role in supporting the ministry's efforts to improve social services and achieve sustainable results for those who need it most. Regional Coordinator for Caritas Antilles, Marcia Haywood, emphasized that introducing the FRM will promote greater transparency, accountability and responsibility. Many of the people that we serve are actually the same target group that the ministry or the government works with. So we work in tandem with them. So I think that this initiative will be very useful in ensuring that the future of social protection is I think um, a healthy one, a functional one, and also has an accountability mechanism built in the system. The launch of the feedback redress mechanism reaffirms the commitment of the Ministry of Equity, Social Justice and Empowerment to building resilient communities and ensuring that every citizen can live with respect and security. From the Ministry of Equity, Social Justice and Empowerment, Anisia Antoine.